Well, it's snowing. You knew this was coming, didn't you? We all knew that this was coming. All of us did. You know, people, when Sony Pictures Animation decided they were going to scrap Gendy Tartakovsky's Popeye remake for the Emoji Movie, everyone lost their minds! How about now? I'll take, uh, boof for 200, Alex. Uh... All right. A group of pill pushers? This is where the fortune, Joe! But yeah, you pretty much get where I'm going with this, don't you? The reason why Hollywood sucks is because of you people. Because you people buy into this crap! This sports entertainment circus! All right, Trish Stratus. I want you to bark for me like a dog, or you're fired! Eric Bischoff! You're fired! Take out the trash! You're fired. You're fired! I'm telling you, if I were the head at Sony Pictures Animation and I found that something like this happened on my watch, I would fire anyone and anyone and everyone and any everyone and every any everyone and so on and so on and so forth and so on, etc. and so on, that thought that the emoji idea was ever going to be a good idea in the first place because we all know that it wasn't, was it? No! It was a terrible idea! It sucked! So keep watching CNN 24 hours a day and call this number... Yeah, dumb son of a sauce. You don't watch CNN 24 hours a day. CNN is fake news. It's fake. It's absolutely fake. There's just no way around that. You can't say it any other way. It's fake. It's fake. CNN is fake news. And you can tell those people at CNN to go forget everything else, right? Right. 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 We're off to see the Pedos, the Hollywood Pedos of Oz. In California, you can see the Cosby's and Bubbles and Cox. In Hollywood, there is a bunch of them where you can find, where you can find, because, 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 because there are a bunch of molesters there. We're off to see the pedos. The so Obama's cohorts in his former administration are trying to undermine Donald Trump's impersonation. Or actually, no, his administration, not his impersonation. Why did I say that for? I meant to say administration. But you get where I'm coming from, right? Basically, what I'm trying to say is Obama and his Democratic scumbags 
are trying to undermine Trump and his administration. Um, is it because he's black? No! There's no race card involved here! Okay, sir. You're going to have to calm down. No! But, sir. No! Okay, sir. No! Can I just get you the bad bank? They can fill up my largemouth bass. Terry Funk the Philippines. They can fill up my Charlie Hoss. Hot diggity! We're gonna have a swinging town in the town tonight. Hey! Okay, can somebody please explain to me what's going on? Yeah, I wanna know too. You'll get that chance. I don't even care. I like this where this is going, you know? I really do. I like where this is going. Yeah, keep going, buddy. You want him to keep going? Yeah! Honestly, I think he should just take his ball and go home because he's already scored the winning basket and then some. Ah, screw that. Let him do what he does best and commentate on the freaking news because that's what he's good at. Skulls. View Entertainment will do whatever the godly I want because nobody can stop me and nobody can kill me and nobody can do a thing to me. So you did lie about I didn't lie. So Steven Hillenberg is apparently suffering from ALS. Really? Why is that? Yeah, I want to know too. I don't know, man. I don't care. Maybe we should know. Yeah, that's a great idea. Basically, the diagnosis came shortly after he returned to service executive producer on his flagship show, SpongeBob SquarePants, the longest running and most overrated show in Nickelodeon history. And for some reason, um,. His diagnosis came after he returned, and he announced it publicly to the world that he had ALS. Hence, all these ice bucket challenges that had been going on in the months and years prior. And he decided that he was going to stay on the show as long as he was able to. As long as it was physically possible for him to. And I don't blame the guy. I think he's doing the right thing here. Good work, Mr. Hillenberg! You got a special place in heaven coming for you, buddy. Yep, I totally just want home. Wait! Don't buy an animated movie from Sony. Let's take a look at this phrase. Some people say, I can. A better Kool Aid commercial! It's
Oh. <laughs>